Hello everyone and welcome to this week's update. I hope that you and your families are well and have had a good weekend um, and everything like that is going well for you. So again, another fantastic week in school, really, really busy. Uh, students have been absolutely fantastic up and down the school from reception to year 11. It's been lovely to see so many of you at year 11 parents evening. That was brilliant. So many in for different sessions. We've got loads going on at the moment. We've got like our attendance draws going on in primary and secondary. We've got loads and loads of work around the residentials going on, all the uh, rewards trips we're planning for the back end of term and also gearing up for all the assessments and the exams as I keep on going on about. Just a reminder around attendance, please make sure that is high. We dipped again last week. It does worry me that we're not in school enough. We're sending uh, letters home, texts home, we're getting those home visits in, but really we need your support getting your children to school. It is the biggest indicator of success. Those children who come to school get better grades. The children who get better grades get better jobs. Those children then, or those better jobs, mean they earn more money. It's really important we get to school for happiness, for well-being, all of those different things. So please do support us uh, with that and getting children into school. And then just a, a reminder around strike days. Um, you know why we're doing it. I've sent that letter home. It's really important we support staff who are striking, making sure that we understand that education is in crisis at the moment. We've got to make sure that we do get that funding required from the government uh, and doing everything that we can possibly. Possibly. So uh, to those staff who are striking, really support those staff. Um, um, but it does mean um, after the first strike, we now know who is going to strike. More than likely, obviously it could change. But at the moment, primary is going to be open and uh, years 10 and 11 are going to be open on Tuesday. So that's all of primary and years 10 and 11. So I'm going to split off into the two separate videos now. Have a great week and I will speak to you again soon. Okay, so hello everyone. And uh, it's been a really, really busy week in primary again. Uh, fantastic to see so many faces in the building uh, in, in and about. Um, and and we are really planning loads. Two big residentials coming up in phase two at Bolton Brow. I think that's in uh, year four, I think. And then we've got the year six residential coming up soon as well. So really, really exciting with that. And thank you for all the support around that. Just a few messages from me before I leave you with a little video of the overview of the week. So you can actually see what your children have been doing. Reading, please make sure we are reading every single day with our children. It's massively important. We are going to be running opportunities after school where you can come in at the end of the bell just come in and do your reading there but if you can read for 10 to 20 minutes every single day with your child it is going to make such a massive improvement and even when they get to years three four five six they can read on their own listening to them listening to their expression all of the other things it makes such a big difference to children's achievement so we're going to put be putting those on there's loads of stuff going on with um, numeracy and with maths especially with the multiplication check in year four so we've got that going on as well and i know that um uh, Mrs Much has been putting absolutely loads on, as Miss Halstead and Mr Adams in their phases as well. Again, um, just fantastic to see so many fantastic things going on. And I'm going to leave you with a short video now of just a, an overview of the week. Thanks very much, everyone. And I'll speak to you again next week. <laughs> I know that birds have a big and all the, and all birds lay eggs. Birds have a long time to have wings. Birds have 
Some cannot fly, can they?